in a York County community are expressing concerns over an after-school Satan Club, a program offered by the Satanic Temple that could find its way to a local elementary school. Fox 43's Chelsea Johnson explains how parents of the students are feeling. They already took you know, God out of schools, but now they're going to allow Satan in. It's just crazy. Parents expressing their outrage over the after school Satan Club. This uh, is very concerning to me. Um, anything that has to deal with uh, worshiping Satan is uh, bad news. The after school Satan Club is a program offered by the Satanic Temple. There are currently four of these programs operating in the country, including in Ohio and Indiana. Pennsylvania could be their next landing spot at Northern Elementary School. We on theistic religion, we don't advocate for any supernatural points of view. While Reeves says this isn't an organization that worships Satan or promotes any sort of religion, one mother says that is not an excuse for a program like this. Once I want to give you a look at the gathering here over my shoulder. The bagpipes have just started playing once again. This is all happening because the newly formed After School Satan Club is holding an open house to tell parents about their new program today. It just happens to be on the same day that another religious group, the Good News Club, is holding its open house. The Satanic Temple says it's providing the uh, After School Club because uh, the Good News Club, an evangelical Bible study group, has actually been around now for several years. The co-founder of the Satanic Temple tells me that if the evangelical group was here, they wouldn't be here either. We feel that evangelical clubs coming in and proselytizing to children, trying to get other children to convert to uh, their fundamentalist way of thinking creates a need for us to be here with something that presents uh, scientific rationalism in, uh, in, uh, uh, by being put forward by a different religious group. They want to balance with Satan? Well... We think people are very much, and we know they are, very much uh, afraid of Satan and Satanism, what it represents, regardless of the comical little drawings they make. Parents and others are concerned about plans for an after-school Satan club at an elementary school. Because I do not want to kneel to Nebuchadnezzar. I want it to be known that I stood when everyone else kneeled. And It start. It, it, oh, we're 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 reasonable. We're 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 putting the self. Worship yourself. It, it start. This is this is where this is where it starts. This is why America is in the state that it's in. Because we are worshiping ourselves and not our God. I want to give all the praises and the honor to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah Bahashem, Racha Ha Kodash. And double honors to the elder apostles and elder bishops of Great Millstone. Honors also to you other brethren, you followers of the truth, you few sisters. And shalom to the elect. Anyway, I came across <clears throat> this video here. I'll give a short commentary on it before getting a few scriptures. But um, uh, this is some movement that started a few years back. And it's making its way to the schools uh, called the the after school program of Satan right the after after school Satan program or something like that let me see what it's actually called the Satan after school club right that's what it's called and then you see I don't know if I put the clip in there the evangelical Christ, the Christians and the Satanists they feel they're in some spiritual warfare right uh, but they're not because they're both Satanists. <laughs> you know, what's not being told is the Christianity that you see today was built off bloodshed, murder, deceit, unethical, immoral behavior that um, was fueled by Satan. So they voted and they, they won the vote at one particular school. But do you know how this man worked? They're just going to change the name, call it something else, give it a couple of some cookies and ice cream, have your kids come there, your children, and it'll all be the same thing, just under a different name. This is all a trial run. So I just wanted to touch on that. The, the whole point of the video is that I want to make is that they both, the school you in is, is of Satan. They claim it was of God. There was a little more morals with it. 
They even upheld some biblical beliefs to a degree, but it was all built, the foundation of it was all built off of corruption, right? It was all corruption. Let's get 2 Corinthians 2 and 11. It said, lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Us, in the truth, are not ignorant of his devices. That is well known. What they're doing in the front, so to speak, in the front of everything, is their name is the Church of Satan. But we all know, let's go to this scripture. 2 Corinthians 11 and 14. Okay, it says, for such are false apostles, deceitful workers, transforming themselves into apostles of Christ, Yahweh Right? This is going into, you know, these Israelites and even these pastors, certain ones. Okay, and it says, And no marvel, for Satan himself is transformed into the angel of light. So what these people don't see is that all these people, all these Satan is going to do is change their name and they're going to transform into something that's more glorious and more beautiful. Kind of like the Boy Scouts. With all the pedophilia and stuff that goes on in there out of the Roman Catholic Church. I don't know. That is just the sickest. But that was another, that's another way of doing that. All he's going to do is change the name, change the whole setup, and call it something else. They might call it the uh, Angels of Light after school program. And you know what's going to happen? The people are going to flock there. This is just done to see how many people will accept it. But all they're going to do is switch it, and they're going to call it the Angels of Light, right? <laughs> and then all, the next thing you know, your children be up in there, man. You know, I don't understand the, the, the moral fabrication of the society, well, we do, about all the lies that was set up in the deceit under the banner of Christianity. And even Christian nationalism, which the KKK is a part of, right? And them white wing Christians who believe blacks are just people that deserve to be slaves under, you know, uh, under uh, under the society. So when you really look at it, they're all Satanists. They're all set up. When you look at it, Second Thessalonians two and nine. It says, even him who's coming is after the working of Satan, with all powers and signs and lying wonders. Right. And with all deceivableness of unrighteousness in them that perish because they receive not the love of the truth that they might be saved. So really all they had to do is give some, they wasn't going to do some after school Christian program because a lot of parents don't like their children in religion. Right. So they're going to have to call it something else. The after school angels of light. Right. And they'll give a couple of cupcakes go on a couple of field trips, teach them a couple of things, and they'll be hooked, right? They'll be looking forward to going and doing it. It's always been like that. This is how they, this man has took you down. He's learned from us, really. You know, they, you learn that it's a process of time when, when someone's going down or to, or to push something on somebody. All these, these uh, policies and laws that you see today that was in the working years ago. Okay. And it says, and for this cause, God, Yahweh shall send them, a, a, uh, them strong delusion that they should believe a lie. That's right. That's what they're going to do. They're more likely going to call it something else. And then they'll say, oh, this is where my child needs to be. This is the same thing about uh, the truth. You know, uh, people into those, those churches. Or they might be in a church and they might fall off and go into some other doctrine, the flat earth and whatever else, you know, and, and change their whole doctrine. That's what happens. So we can see that this is a, a process in the making. It doesn't have to happen overnight, you know, but um, they, they're going to see how the reaction is. And um, the Most High is just bringing, you know, all kinds of plagues, judgment. You know, sicknesses and everything else you can imagine. The Most High starting to send all that forward. This is the, and these people are after the children. Notice that. 
it's a lot I can't say in this video, but there's things that wasn't lawful has become form of you know a form of lawfulness. I don't know, but you know I can't really say it. But we just know that the children, your sons and daughters, are under attack. Anyway, that's all I have on that. Shalom.